Hello and welcome to a series that I affectionately call uh, Relinquished Ranked, where I am a duelist that I love Relinquished a bit too much. And uh, admittedly, I'm starting the series two days before the uh, ladder resets, but that's fine. Hi, the goal of the series is we are going to try to get Relinquished to Master Rank. Uh, have I ever been to Master Rank? No. Uh, highest I ever got was like gold three, so uh, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Wish me luck. Uh, the goal of today's episode is just to get into uh, either silver or bronze. Probably try to get to bronze. Next episode, we'll be dealing with bronze once we kind of... We're going to wait for the ladder to kind of reset, and then we're going to try to take on bronze best we can, so... Sit back and relax, and let's uh, enjoy some duels. All right, this is our current deck build for Relinquished. It's a bit goofy. It's a bit silly. Uh, this is just kind of to be a placeholder until uh, I can really kind of finesse it into where I like it. So just to kind of understand it. Three regular Thousand Eyes Idols, because I don't really care for the retrain. Kinky Bio, because I think it's a pretty interesting tech card that gets uh, Relinquished back to the field. Spear Freebo. Uh, it can do it in the graveyard, and it has a bit of battle protection for us. This allows us to add another target to our Relinquish cards and our Restrict card. Sangan, Sangan. Uh, eventually we'll add Tour Guide. Tour Guide is just uh, an altar right now, so <laughs> we'll see. Two Ash, three Manju. Uh, and with Manju being a light, I went ahead and threw this bad boy in the deck, because I think the memes are funny. Uh... <laughs> Illusionist Facial Faceless Magician, the retrain of the Illusionist card uh, from OG Yu-Gi-Oh! And Lava Golem, because I think this is funnier than any kaiju you could offer me. Uh, Guy Geki, Monster Born, three pre-preparation of rights. It's essentially a very faster Manju, uh, but I would like to have multiple opportunities to get these cards in our hand. Uh, we got two Lightning Storm, three Black Illusion Ritual, two Advanced Ritual Arts, just because we have the 3,000 Eyes Super Poly. Which I've loaded our extra deck with a few cards uh, for that. Uh, then we have Relinquish Fusion and Imperm. Uh, I might move this to three. I don't know. I might take out this. I'm not sure. Because the three preparation kind of covers what this does uh, pretty easily. So without further ado, that is our deck. Let's get into ranked. <laughs> I like have fun at Dimitri. I get to pick. We are picking second. This is a going second deck. We are using the, the fact that this is a one of format to basically go second as often as possible and hope that gets our opponent. Uh, it's pretty. Okay, so we're, we're not doing too bad. We got a decent amount of stuff here. I guess my decent one. I'm thinking possibly, I think what they summon out, Super Poly? Okay, so we got Yaku Sunder, and we got this. Uh -huh. I'm glad to wing clearing board at this point. I don't mind. We got some Photon Dragon. Just play. We're actually playing now. Okay, let's activate the first. Okay, we have a second one. We got one. Okay, cool, cool. Not sure what I can target here, but we'll try our best. Alright, what 
they gonna do here? Imperm, okay. Let's go and activate Super Poly here. Discard this. All right, we're gonna grab this bad boy. Give me. Thank you. Okay. Got it. What, what do you got here? Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and grab uh, this bad boy. Damn, they got so much going on here. Damn. Uh, I don't really have anything for this. So I think we're sadly gonna have to surrender our first duel. Uh, because <laughs> they had the out. Sadly, they had the out. So we have to surrender our first match. All right. Uh, let's hope this second duel goes better than the first. Possibly. <laughs> Very possibly. Please let me go second. Please. Ah, my deck's not built for first. My deck is not built for first, sadly. Alright, uh... This is something. Um, yeah, we're gonna... I don't, I don't really know what to do here, so we're just gonna... Yeah. I like how we get Chaos Emperor Dragon two duels in a row, opening hand. It's not... It is a dead draw. It's supposed to be a haha -ha funny. It is not supposed to be. <laughs> it's not supposed to be anything else. I promise to. Cool. Uh, so as long as we survive this, we're chill. As long, long as we survive, we're chill. That's the beauty. That is the beauty of uh, of uh, early ranks. Is technically it's possible not to die. So we'll just have to pray and hope uh, our opponent is like kind of newbie because <laughs> we do have relinquish here. Hell, even if we get Relinquished Fusion, we're pretty good, all things considered. Why did you end? You can battle. That's fine. That's actually really funny. Uh, so I have no reason to get rid of his uh, monsters, but I do have reason to get rid of these. So Lightning Store. No face-up cards on the field. What, are you good? You were like... It's my turn, and you are just chilling. Are you okay? You understand? Okay, cool. <laughs> cool. All right. Lightning storm. Go ahead and destroy all the spells and traps, because I need his monsters. You you have an out to them? You don't. Okay, cool. Oh, my God. You really are playing the, like, structure deck. I am so sorry, sir. I am so sorry. Flip up my thousand eyes idle. Go ahead and you know what? That's smart of me. Haha. -ha. We're gonna have a little fun here. We technically do this. Um, but we don't have any normal monsters in hand, so we're gonna have to go with this bad boy. Yeah boy. And we are not done. Let's go ahead and take that. Thank you. Activate Black Illusion Ritual. Go ahead and summon you. I'm getting rid of my Chaos Emperor Dragon. Alright, we're gonna just normal summon like normal. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and yoink that other one, baby.
I am so sorry, new player. I am so sorry. See, the uh, entire point of the Linkish to me is I like the idea of the fact that it kind of like uses my uh, opponent's strength against them. Because we're in a, we're kind of in a format where summoning out big, powerful boss monsters is not hard to come by. Like, that's... And it's typically done within the first turn. So, by going second, you know, obviously, Relinquish is a big, beefy boy. Oh, hey, he's actually using the effect. Good for him. Good for him. Now, he can attack a Nima. That would be the smarter choice. If he attacks into Relinquish normal, then... Okay, cool. Good for him. Because if he attacks into normal Relinquish, there's, like, a whole effect going on with that one. You know, it's, it's a mess. All right, draw. We draw into Thousand Eyes Idol. That is a card. Uh, doesn't really do anything for us currently. So uh, I am thinking. So I am thinking, since if this card battles during damage step, that would break this, and then I could probably once per turn. Cool. Yeah, we can. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? Let's go ahead and bonk into you. Activate your effect. But, bam, and then we go to main phase two. Activate my effect. We can grab you. We have no threats. We're a little bit weaker now, but we have no threats, realistically, right now in this deck. Yeah, that's another kind of problem with it I have found, is that it really uh, depends on the kind of momentum of the game. I have to kind of work with their momentum, because I can only go so fast. Okay, interesting. They might actually be. They might actually be smart with this one. They they might have an out to go Relinquish. If they summon two monsters, that does out Relinquish. Yeah, it's one Relinquish, and we can get a Nima, no problem. But. Hey! Smart. Yeah, going to that, 500. Activate the effect. You take 500 too. And if you attack with that, yep. You're smart. You're smart. I I respect you for understanding the the weaknesses of relinquish. It it has its strengths. It definitely has its weaknesses. Alright, so uh, another <laughs> Why have we top deck two thousand eyes idols? Alright, that's fine. Um okay, we we essentially just have, I think, another anima for the circumstance that's all we can really do right now so we're gonna go ahead and do that just to kind of get rid of them all right give me your give me your monster Thank you. End my turn. Because I can't really battle them. We top deck my three idols. My three idols. And if he can somehow get... I don't know. He has outs. I, I hope he, he realizes that. Oh, he actually has an out to this. Appreciate it. I just have to kind of hope I get something Uh, next turn. Something. He's... He's summoning. Koji Koji Dragon. I think that's a decent one. Let me look at that. Yeah, when the card destroys a monster by battle, you can send it to the graveyard. You can detach. Good for him. Good for him. I might not have the out for this. He can detach. Yeah, he can detach. If I don't top deck something, I'm kind of screwed. Can't believe I'm I'm having a very competitive match with my relinquished deck. You, why didn't you do the second battle? That's that's so weird. Why didn't you battle? Sangan. Okay. I had something. Alright, cool. We're gonna have to rely on the fact that he doesn't <laughs> that he doesn't kill me this turn. Uh is the hope. Is like literally all we have to hope. 
Because if Sand Gang gets bashed into, we can grab Relinquished. We're good to go. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. So regardless of what happens here, I am good to go on getting Relinquished. I think I two and do I just have one in graveyard? I just have one in graveyard. Alright, what are you gonna do? Okay, you are Okay. Good on you, bud. Alright, go ahead and destroy Sangan. Sangan activates, allowing me to grab. Okay. Yep. Alright, cool. Uh let's go ahead and grab you Okay, you're gonna make the second attack button? Yes you are. Good job. <laughs> that sounds mean to me. I shouldn't be mean. Uh I'm like I'm losing to the starter deck pretty badly here. Like we're pretty evenly matched, and I hate that for me. Uh in perm. Ooh, Call of the Haunted? What are you grabbing from Call of the Haunted? What do you have? Do you even grab? You have like Blade War Blade Knight? Probably Blade Knight. Um Nah, I can't really yeah, it's just Blade Knight. I'm not too upset. You know what we can mess with his Blade Knight. Oh, I could have probably done two of them. I I forgot about placement. Let's have a little fun. Get rid of that. Activate that. Special them in that. Get rid of that. Alright. Summon you. Please, no more Thousand Eyes Idols. Please, I am begging you. Debating on taking them out of the deck now because of that. <laughs> Emmy, you. Yeah, you're in my field now, baby. Alright, battle. Get rid of this boy. Alright. So now let's end the turn, and hopefully we can win this. It'd be funny if we couldn't. Right. Uh, hoping and praying I top deck something interesting. Monster Reborn. What do I have in my graveyard for Monster Reborn? Oh, but it has to be Special Summon. Must be Special Summon from the hand by Vanishing. That is not useful to me. What about you? What do you got? What do you got? You got Blade Warrior? That's interesting. You know what? Let's just see what we got here. Activate Monster Reborn. Targeting. Hmm. I think it would be fun to grab this, but... See. You know, let's have a fun. Let's bring back another relinquish. Because relinquish can actually still grab. I'm gonna grab you. That's right. We can just grab stuff. We can just grab stuff. It's cool like that. Alright, let's end our turn. So now we have two, and it has battle protection, so anything he throws at it, no matter what he top decks, we got something. Alright, what are you going to pull out? I've relinquished with nothing, because it stole your monster. What do you got? Okay, he's setting one. Alright, uh, I'm curious. All right, top deck something interesting, top deck something interesting, top deck something interesting. Kinkabio, it's something. Kinkabio, activate the effect of Kinkabio. Uh, let's go ahead and grab one of our idols. Um, And then we could, we can only link one. That's okay. I'm going to battle in for bid 25. And end my turn. 
And I can view, has to go back to hand because it is a spirit monster. I know those aren't used that often. I wasn't sure what was in my graveyard for King Kibio, so in my defense on that one. I could just look. Hey, you got a monster. Do note that if you attack into me, you lose. If you attack into me, you lose. I am so sorry. I am so sorry. But we got our first win within rookie rank. Uh, our deck definitely needs some work, and I will be working on it. We're, hey, we're rookie one. Hello, so this is the current build of the deck. Uh, it is the next day before I do my final uh, rookie duel. Hopefully it's the last rookie duel. I uh, did a little tweaking. Made it a little bit more meta, I suppose. I pulled a Ash Blossom. And, and, you know, the name of the champion's pack. And then I also pulled a copy of Evenly Matched. So I thought I'd throw that in. And then we also have an Access Code Talker. I tweaked some things, threw in the Golden Eyes Idol instead of the Advanced Ritual Art. And then, yeah, pretty much that's, that's it. This is the deck currently. Uh, I'm kind of debating on some aspects of it, some stuff I could take out. But I like it so far, and, you know... I like getting my own spin of uh, stuff I like in my decks. So, uh, best of luck for the next round. All right, we are fighting Raven Snack. Hoping for the best. We're going to go second. Because, of course, we are. We're going to hope for the best. We are, we have a hand here, but to be fair, this hand does get us uh, relinquished and it possibly gets us uh, subsequently <laughs> anything else we need, so. All right, finding a cyber dark deck, the structure deck. Also just seeing what I can make here real quick while I'm waiting for my opponent. So I do have Storm Grand and Fusion Dragon if they're running any darks. Um, I'm trying to think. And then I also do have this. I have targets. I have targets. I have Violet Artifact. I'm especially in this card from the graveyard. Okay, so we got Cyber Dark Chimera. It is dark, so we can, in fact, uh, grab ourselves a nice, tasty, fat Millennium Eyes Restrict. Okay, that is all they did. Okay. All right, we got Sangan, which actually <laughs> overpowers this thing. That's perfectly fine. Um, should I just attack in with Sangan? Should I just attack in with Sangan? Um, you know what? Yeah, let's just normal summon Sangan here. Go and activate our pre-requisition. Uh, pre. I can talk. Pre-preparations of right. Uh, rich right. I cannot fucking talk. All right, so we got everything we need. And activate this. Eh, you know what? Let's do it. Hmm. I guess I have to. This is one that I restrict. You know what? Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Hand me this bad boy. I made a little bit of a goof. Uh, I did just wake up, so I'm allowing myself a little bit of goofing and gaffing. I might just be bad at Yu-Gi-Oh, to be fair, so. Hey, good for you, bud. That's a level one, right? Yeah, I'm fine. I have Kinky B.O. Looks on you, I have this thing. So I'm good. I'm chill. So if Millennium Eyes Restrict is level one, yeah, we can special summon this off of Kinky B.O. I'm happy. We're smart. We got, we got stuff going on. Ooh. My, my opponent just disconnected. The, the connection failed. I'm assuming that's on them just like having bad internet. I don't know. 
So yeah, we are now officially in bronze. Woo! All right, with that, we are at the end of the video because essentially the next uh, season is tomorrow, again, tomorrow. So I will see you guys in a couple days when I can do the bronze episode. If you guys enjoyed this one. I'm sorry, I, I'm a terrible duelist. I'm going to practice. I'm going to practice a fair bit. I think I need it.